drie foutig, dit gaan oor het spiritual bike journey, het gaan oor een drie dae stage race, en dan gaan het oor developing trail nodes along the way, so dat daar klein mountain bike trail areas ontstaan op die verskillende punte van die bike neem. We came here, we saw the landscape and we wanted to create something different. Uh, it's also key to Ecobound's sort of ethos is that we don't do just generic stuff, we want to do something different. And we came here, um, explored earlier this year and came up with this idea that we're developing at the moment. And part of this Reiki was also to get feedback exactly on how we will present it. But essentially the idea is to have a more touring, relaxed uh, environment for guys to ride through this beautiful landscape. Pilgrims from all over the world have embarked on Camino trails across Europe for centuries. Today, more than a pilgrimage, the Camino is an unforgettable experience and unique journey and invites the participants to venture inward and leave the conventional world's stresses behind. The Namakwa coastal route by Camino starts with a stay at the famous Okip Country Hotel that functions as base camp number one. Besides the amazing service, unique local cuisine and comfortable hotel rooms, each participant receives a by Camino passport with an ID photo to be checked in at the different landmarks. To uh, mine, because they brought nice rocks that looked nice and it had the purple colouring in it and, and that's copper. Alright, so they found it in the 1680s, and then in 1685, Simon van der Stel said, right, back up the, the, the oxen wagon, let's leave for Okim. He, he got here, they only started mining here in 1855, the English from Cornwall, the Cornish miners. Meerder is van die tyd blij, ons op die groot pad, daar is een paar, hier in die begin, denk ek, moet ons maar allemaal by mekaar blij, en dan sal ek sê, want ons een bykie kan rij en, en op en afbreek. Bike Camino aims to bring something similar to the Camino culture to the wonderful South African countryside to offer safe and open routes with a support and opportunity to learn about our country's nature, unique history and diverse cultures. The semi-desert landscape makes for a perfect backdrop to achieve this goal of the creation of the spiritual journey into oneself. The first leg is between the mining towns of Okip and Nababib through Namakwalan's Klipkopen region with granite boulders strewn like confetti over the landscape. Nababib is a Khoi word that means small stream. Remnants from the heydays of the mines tower over this quaint little town. The route takes us westward towards Nikhramuk Mines and through a very impressive scarp profile canyon that cuts so deep into the landscape that it's visible from space. Large succulents known as quiver trees, indigenous to this land, dots the countryside. The sun people hollowed out the trunks of these trees to use as a quiver for their arrows. Lelike finds. Oei. Hy dink ons moet sommer nou begin, Jack. Het jy um het jy 'n platsnoekie ingepak vir finds gehad? Ek dink iets geer wat daar boe. Boe, okay. Platsnoekie. Maar ons ons probeer ook dat lief vir 'n braai en hy sê ja, jylle kan nie daai reetpryk gaan surf sonder platsnoekie. Hy sê wat is platsnoekie? Hy sê kop, wat ek jylle bietjie vertel. Platsnoek is is hierdie gatsap botteltjie OBS wat so in pas. So hy pas daar, dus in die makwa wat word by die platsnoek genoem. So basis hoe dit werk, voor jy in die, in die water kom gaan, knak jy jou platsnoekie en vat die paar slikkies en dan berg jy jou mee achter in jou wetsoek terwyl jy uitpad. En dan, wanneer jy nou op die backline is, voor jy aan die gang raak met jou eerste brande, dan vat jy so een of twee slikkies platsnoek in die voortuur, is wat ek van zijne geneem het, op die achterkant van by die wrakke by. Man, 
it's been good, eh? Um, uh, this technical thing has kept my hands going, but um, uh, so far so good. Loving it. Day one, and almost 70 kilometers later, we arrive at Nari's Namakwa retreat. I've come this in like about two weeks. I think it was amazingly fun right now. It's a little bit sore, but yes, it's beautiful. Um, that last climb on the top, I think in summer that will that'll really be, that'll be a breaker. But now it's all right, it's hard. It was getting hot, but there's a little bit of a tailwind, so it's like, yes. I can not say church. Um, uh, I was bang for the finds that are going to come to the to be in the as a result of root choice. But on the stadium, it's like a positive <laughs> Janine is from Open Africa um, uh, and she is actually a great deal of this whole concept. She is from the beginning of all the meetings and she is fantastic with the admin so far and all the logistical so reelings. So, um, uh, bye, thank you Janine and thank you for having us. We it's really a great big pleasure. Welcome. It's, thank you. it's awesome having you here. And the idea of these routes is that we, we establish something um, a, a product that a, that a tourist coming to the Macmillan can um, get first hand what they can see, what they can do, where they can go. They have a, a route that they can follow. Um, and they know that if they're following the Open Africa branding or the Namaco Coastal Route branding, they're going to get a certain level of service, they're going to get a certain commitment to um, uh, to the environment as well as giving new entrepreneurs a leg up in the business. So you're on your journey from leaving the mountains of, of the Northern Cape, going through the flatlands, dropping down Spectacle Pass is spectacular. Maar hier, hier is het nou bosveld. 
want die kerel het uit die boesmeland uit moes, hy vlug en hier naartoe kom. En dat was nou oorleving daarom vir hom ook een bykie vir sy skaap. Verder dat hy nie, sal hy dat die maak as hy moes in die boesmeland gaan blijven. klein blommetjes en wat al wij. Het is net ongelooflijk, ek rij op en ek sien die blommetjes en ek gaan een beetje af, toe ek weer opkom, het is omtrent 50 meer. En soos jy rij raak klink meer en meer soos die son opkom en die bloed rooi in die middel van een klip. Het is net ongelooflijk mooi. Het raak al hoe mooi soos jy opgaan en toe jy nou afkom in die in die rivier weer in en so en nou nou gaan jy nou change die landskap weer. I think it's it's the ever changing landscape. If you only look, you know, if you drive through it, you see you see rocks and, and small little bushes. But it, actually, if you're observant and you travel through it, it's always changing. There's always something interesting to look at. but you never back in star I my you can Hier is nou maar net vast bij het van hier naar voren toe. Oké, are we rolling? Ja. Incredible rocky, ro rocky terrain, descend into this most amazing plain, packed for like 15 saw. proper k's. This, it's like absurd. Rob had to hollow out is, a, a, I mean, a dead fox so that we could eat. And, and it's just unreal. For shade. Yes. You know, it's amazing when I provide good footage and then you just go... <laughs> every I'm, time. I'm adding the factual stuff. Just when we went into the park, Vino came next to me and he says, so, are you gonna, like somebody's word, um, uh, uh, can I use the word that you say, you're not gonna ass up the hill again? I said, no, no, we just got a bit of sand at the end. <laughs> Kenna oom Dudley en sy vrou kuiter vir ons vanavond, nee, so dat ek alles... Hij klei, zoals je met klachtlangs in het daarboer, en hier staat ook een klei. Ik, uh, ook een klei. Dit was weer een ander gezin wat ook niet had Zo, so, met andere woorden, die koek van ten plaats, zoals hij nou is, was twee eienaars. Hier komt die klipgedeelte af. Dat is waar die grensdraad tussen die twee 
blazer geweest het. En het is niet even flower season, het is it's, it's out of season, het is mei voor de Makwaland, dat is hun dead season. En er is zoveel te zien en zoveel te observen. En ik denk dat is wat dat headspace as well. A land of deathful sleep, where fitful dreams of hurrying spring scars wake swift fading flowers. A land of fleckless sky and sheer shed beams of sun and stars through days and dark slow hours. A land where sand is choked once fluent streams, where grassless plains like girt by granite towers, that fright the swift and heaven nurtured teams of winds that bear afar the sea clean showers. The wild Atlantic. Fretted by the breath of fiery gales over leagues of desert sped, rolls back and wrecks in surf's thunderous wrath on rocks that down the wan, wide shore are spread. The waves forever roar a song of death, the shore they roar to is forever dead. Nie net oor seese mense, maar ook baie Suid-Afrikaners bring wat lief is vir die buitenlucht. Dus uitstekend. Je ziet niet in jullie omgeving. Dus in jullie andere perspectief als met de kar. Dus fantastisch nee. Oh, jij Nice. You were nominated to be sprayed. Now lick it off you. <laughs> oh, Dino. Beautiful. Uh, I've, got the, I've got the camera. Yeah, you're welcome. Uh, <laughs> <laughs>